Hello friends, welcome to Elder Pixels. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, this is a 32 inch Samsung LED TV. You can see this is the model number. This TV comes to me for repair. Here, the complaint is no power issue. While checking, here we found that due to lightning, the main IC of this motherboard is damaged. So, here instead of installing universal LED LCD board, here we are going to install alternate Samsung motherboard in this TV. See friends, this is the original motherboard. Here we are going to install this alternate original Samsung motherboard. Here in this alternate motherboard, it has some additional features. It supports internet sharing and screen casting feature so here in this motherboard due to lightning the main ac is damaged so let us remove this motherboard from the tv see friends now we remove this motherboard so instead of this motherboard let us place this alternate samsung motherboard See friends, now we fixed the new alternate Samsung motherboard instead of that faulty motherboard. So now let us connect all sockets. It's a 32 inch HD panel. See friends, now we connected the speaker wires, sensors and all sockets here for fixing this Wi-Fi module in this cabin there is a default lock also see friends in this lock we can fix this Wi-Fi module here so friends now everything is done so now let us connect the 19 volt DC adapter see friends now we connected the adapter now let us power on the TV and check the picture see friends now the TV is turned on here you can see the standby light see friends now the Samsung logo comes and here you can see the final result now the TV is working properly. See friends, instead of using LCD LED Universal U11 board, here we installed alternate Samsung motherboard. See friends, but to fix the back core of the TV, we need to do a small modification. See friends, here we cut down some portions of the back cover to fit this motherboard. See friends. So, after doing this modification, now all sockets are properly fitted. So, now we need to cover these holes. For covering these holes properly, we use a double side tape. See friends, using a double side tape, now we covered the empty holes. See friends, now all empty holes are covered properly. Now from the outside, we can use a black tape. See friends, I am using this black tape.
to cover the empty space from outside so see friends finally now everything is done here you can see the final result now the tv is working properly and the tv is repaired successfully so if you like our channel please don't forget to like share subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications see you in another video with another interesting topics thanks for watching